Beauties, the time has come where I must pack for Coachella. It is April 6th today, but I'm going home for Easter over the weekend to Vancouver. And so I kind of want to get this squared away because I only have two days at home before I go to Coachella. Whoa, sorry, that was very loud vibrate. I have all my things, ideas laid out on my bed. I'm going to check my Pinterest again to give me some guidance and we're just going to build outfits together. And I just want to preface by saying this is not, I don't want to dress in a traditional sort of festival -y look. I just want to be comfy and just wear outfits that I feel good in, not really going to any sort of like theme or anything. Also, some of these pieces were kindly gifted by Reformation, so I'm gonna style some of their pieces. It's just also stuff that I've had in my wardrobe that I think will work, and I also just checked the weather. It's not looking super hot, so to me, 25, 26, 27 is pretty mild summer temps. Needless to say, it's not gonna be that hot, so I think I actually can get away with wearing pants some days, long sleeves, that sort of thing, especially since it gets cold at night. So, let us get into the outfit planning process. Okay, in my head, when I was thinking about outfits, I really wanted to wear these shorts. I just love like track shorts with a little bit more elevated top. This is the one I got from Reformation. I guess I didn't show any, did I show it in a vlog? I can't remember. But this top is from Reformation, and I thought this kind of like high-low sort of look would be cool. Let's accessorize a bit, and we'll see. Also, I ordered a pair of Asics from Aritzia. I will insert a photo here, but they just arrived to my boyfriend's house, not my house, so I can't include them in this video, but they look similar to these old Hoka's that I have. They're gray, so... I'm probably just gonna wear sneakers. I thought about maybe bringing my Blundstones, but... I don't know. I don't know if they'll go with every look. I'll try my Blundstones on. I can already tell this is not going to be a look, but I want to just accessorize. Humor me for a second. I actually really love the way this looks. I think if I could wear different shoes, like wear this as like an outfit not for Coachella, I totally would just with like a pair of clogs or something. But I think this look with sneakers is not my favorite. Um, and I don't think the Blundstones are going to work. This is the backpack I wanna bring. I have had this for years, I got it at Belly Village. It has a bladder in it and I think, I, I just like would rather have a bladder than carrying a water bottle, it just seems easier to me. And I don't know, I would totally wear this out. I just don't think it's a festy day look. And I was honestly really worried about how this backpack was gonna look with everything. And confirmed, I don't love it, but <laughs> I think it's just gonna have to work. I also really want to look to see if there's maybe like a crossbody, like eight liter bag at like MEC or something that could work. But I like the purple of this. It's a cute color. I just don't know if it's gonna go with everything. Okay, confirmed. This is not gonna work. Would wear it during the summer sometime. <laughs> I feel like because of the nature of the outfit, the Adidas shorts might not work either, especially with sneakers. I think it might just be like a little bit too casual for my liking so I'm gonna try a different bottom maybe like a skirt or something okay I actually don't hate the Blundstones but I think we need different bottoms for sure okay I have two little skirts this one is from Los Angeles Apparel it's just like a cream this is their I don't know what design this is it's just their score it's like cotton stretchy and then I have this really cute um, this is the cruise stretch mini skirt from the foundational if I want to go with black Which also could be cute. I think I'm gonna do like a monochromatic look One day or maybe all of the days honestly. I really like the way that looks recently, but I think I'm gonna try this on Okay, this is cute, but I do not like the way that this looks together I think the way that this sits is just not my favorite. So this is out. This also very cute, but I don't know if it works with the top. What do y'all think? I don't know. I like this and then like a little belt something. I don't know. But 
I almost might wear the denim skirt with this top. I really like this scenario. Stumped on bottoms. I honestly probably also could get away with wearing full length jeans. Like Friday, it's only supposed to be 25 degrees and to me that's jeans and a tank top. So, ooh, maybe I'll do that. Okay, my first instinct was to go with these uh, thrifted Levi's that have like paint splatters and stuff on them. They're like a little bit more low waisted, which I feel like is, I don't know, kind of more along with this. I actually don't hate the way it looks with my Blundstones either, but I still don't feel like, yes, this is the look. You know what I mean? So we might have to, we might have to table this one and move on because, I don't know, this is just not inspiring me that much. Also, I bought this hoodie from Aritzia to be the sweater that I bring for the nighttime. I just wanted like something super simple and easy and cozy comfy. Don't really care what it looks like with everything. It's just my little evening layer. Let's table this one, we'll come back to it. Cause I really want to wear this top with something. I'm just feeling a little Hmm. We'll come back. We'll come back to it. Okay, I put this, sorry, I put this skirt back on, or this one on, from Ref, the flounce skirt. I actually really like this. And this could be cute with my Blundstones or sneakers. Yeah, okay, this is something I'd wear. We're getting warmer. We're definitely getting warmer. But let's try something else now. Okay, day two. This just, I don't know, I wasn't even thinking of this. But this gorgeous skirt, the Winnie skirt from Reformation, I love this. It's so comfy. Feels really good on my body. I've had this little strapless top from Aritzia for years and I've never worn it. Just can't ever find an occasion to wear it because it's like, I don't know, it's just a little different. And then I have a bikini top underneath, one that I got from Essence. And then, I don't know, this hat or... This hat, I just feel like it's so cute, also just with my sneakers, and then a fun pair of sunglasses, I don't know. This feels like comfy and fun to me. I would wear this to a festival anywhere, and I don't know, it just feels like a little bit more me. But I don't know if I'm sold on this top with this. I originally just wanted to do bikini top with this skirt. But I don't know if that's a little bit much. Are these sunnies? Let's try a different top just for funsies. Okay, I think I like this Los Angeles apparel tank top with it. Once, I don't know. I think this is cute and I feel good in it, but just like with a little bit more accessories. like. Bracelets, necklaces, that sort of thing. Maybe this is gonna be a video of me like never actually settling on my outfits until I get to Coachella. Which to be honest is probably what's gonna happen. I also have these cute little flower print shorts I got in the Zara sale a couple months ago. And I think this is cute together, but I don't think this is warm enough. I don't know, like it might work for the day and then throw my hoodie on. Okay, we'll see. I also think this could be really cute. I really want to wear these Adidas shorts. Um, this is just like a thrifted top. You've probably seen it before. And then my 437 bikini. Also, I'm dressing way cash. Like, I know that people dress up for this, but I really just want to be so casual and comfy if I could not stress that enough. So I like this. I think this is really cute. What do you think? Okay, we've come back to this top. I tried it on with the, I forgot what the one is called. I think this is the Jade skirt from Reformation. And I actually really like this. So maybe this is the look and I do wear the long denim skirt. It's actually very comfy to be in. Um, and then again, accessorized with the shell necklace. Like, I think this could be really cute. I have my Blundstones on right now, but Maybe you would do sneakers? Yeah, this is cute. I like 
like this actually okay we're making headway okay and then here is the isaac open it dress from reformation i just have my 437 bikini on underneath it's very short um i'm 5'3 just for reference so i would be like if i reach up my butt is definitely out so like i think it could work because i know people wear like really short things um to coachella and i think this could be really cute just the bikini underneath i like that it's long sleeved so yeah definitely an option as a whole outfit on its own let's maybe put a hat on i don't know i just feel like trucker hat really is like festival -y to me so i keep reaching for this maybe not i'll definitely bring this like even just wearing it to go get a coffee or something this is super cute you could also do some like shorts underneath okay those are just like my thrifted gap shorts that's cute too right Meh. no it's not cute i lied to you okay maybe with the little la apparel skirt underneath if you were like one if i want it to be like a little bit more not so short and see-through i just would feel like more secure now this works you can't even like really see it on underneath and it's like the same length which just feels a little bit more not so exposed <laughs> this is a good option i definitely want to bring this because i feel like I may decide to wear it one day or just wearing it like as a pool cover up or around Palm Springs or whatever. I'll bring it. Okay, this is so simple, but this is actually the originally what I wanted to wear, like this exact outfit, and I still might do it. I saved some pictures on Pinterest of like some thicker, like chunkier bead sort of choker. So I might go to the bead store either later today or tomorrow and make myself like a little thick choker. And I think that would look really cute because then it's like a little bit more fun instead of just this plain thing. But these are both from LA Apparel. And I think they look cute with sneakers. And then just my backpack. Again, super simple, but I think with my accessories like sunglasses and necklace and that sort of thing, I can kind of make it feel more me and more, I don't know, fun. But this is really cute. I'm still wearing my bikini underneath. But I really like this. And I like that it's kind of monochrome. It's also so comfy and would be totally good with just like my hoodie over top or something once it gets cold. Also, my boyfriend said that he's going to come drop off my sneakers, so I can show you guys. <laughs> something lovely has happened while I've been filming this video. <laughs> wow. Wow. Saturn return is so real, y'all. Okay, quick interlude, but we're back. This video is potentially not helpful at all to y'all because I'm not actually like finalizing any outfits. Mainly because obviously I also want to just like have new content to share. Uh, but the shoes have arrived, so let's open them. I ordered them from Aritzia. I'm not sure if I mentioned that. I probably did. Also, I'm sorry that the lighting is you saw. I just broke one of my lights. Okay, these are very cute i love them i will say uh aritzia has a, does a really bad job of photographing shoes for like colors like i thought the bottoms were more red but they're definitely just pink they look red online so let's try them on hopefully they fit they look like they'll fit they look really comfy too as you know i love my new balance 530s I did buy another pair of them that I think I wore when I was in Austin and I just didn't like them as much so I actually sold them on my Poshmark but uh, I'm kind of, I can feel myself getting on the tail end of loving them so I thought that these would be like a good summer replacement sneaker. Um, they're very similar, obviously just different brands. Someone, who was I watching? I think I was watching Mada's TikTok and she said, or her Instagram stories and she said that she sized up in these and now i'm realizing why i think they the shoe itself looks kind of it feels kind of snug uh, i got a six which is my usual size but i find that when there's like unifet sex sizing it's tricky oh no these are 
perfect. I can see people wanting to size up. If you have wider feet, you probably would want to go half size bigger. Okay. Now we can fully see these outfits. Also for the plane, I'm probably just going to do whatever pair of jeans I am bringing in this hoodie. And that's it. Oh, I really like these. I'm very excited about them. Okay, let's get back into finding some outfits. <laughs> I also have this cute little crochet. Not with this outfit, I don't think. I think this is like too casual. But I do have this cute little crochet flower that a lovely gal who I'm going to put all of her stuff down below made for me and sent them to me. Oh, this could be cute on the neck. But again, this outfit is too casual. But I'm going to bring it because I feel like it will be cute with something. Like maybe with the long white denim skirt and that flowy top. I think this could be really cute with it. Okay, I just threw this on. This is not a festival look, but I thought this was cute for summer. <laughs> Here's the new sneak on. Could be cute just to bring to wear during the day while we go, I don't know, do things around Palm Springs, but not a festy look. This might be kind of a love-hate one, but I kind of like it. Very me. You know, I love this top. And I really do love this skirt. I just don't know. What do we think? Definitely could wear this on a 24, 25 degree day. It's not that hot, so. I need your help, y'all. I'm, I'm losing sight of the goal. I'm losing sight of what I'm supposed to be dressing for, I think. Okay, I think I'm gonna leave this off here. I am completely stumped. I think I've just kind of lost sight of the direction I wanna go in because I've pulled too many things out of my wardrobe. So here's a rough idea of what I'm bringing to Coachella. You will see the final stuff in my vlogs and all that sort of thing, but maybe this gives you an idea of how I put things together, like what goes on in my mind when I'm trying to dress myself. And please help me. I'm going to edit this as quickly as I can and get it up hopefully tomorrow, which will be the 7th. So you'll still have time to give me some feedback or give me ideas. And yeah, if anything, maybe this just helps with some like summer outfit ideas. I don't know. Okay. Love you all so much. I'll see you in the next one.